of the many investments you'll make in your life, your marriage is perhaps the most important. While talking money with your partner can be challenging, it's absolutely critical to how you'll manage your life together, to avoiding difficult disagreements, and to ensuring you're on a prosperous path together. That's why one of the first things you should do, preferably very early in your marriage, is have a heart-to-heart -heart about your joint financial goals. What do you hope to achieve? Is it an early retirement, a college education for your kids, or a second home? Keep your treasured dreams front and center so that you both know what you're working toward. On that same note, do assign specific responsibilities to each partner. Is one of you better with tax planning or investing than the other? Assign tasks to each partner that they're most comfortable with, but don't allow one partner to do it all. You should each have a stake in managing your joint finances. And don't criticize your partner excessively over their use of money. Candid conversations are fine, but excessive criticism breeds resentment and has destroyed many marriages. But you also don't want to hide major purchases or financial decisions from your mate. A better solution is to allow each partner to keep a separate account with a small amount of their own money to spend as they choose. This helps each partner enjoy a little freedom with their own spending. And don't allow financial problems to fester and erupt into more serious marital difficulties. If you see this happening, it's time to shelve your financial conversations until you can see a financial professional or marital therapist, and preferably both. Do your financial checkups jointly with them in order to avoid the arguments at home. The well-being of your marriage should always be your priority.